change yourself, rebrand. Like what you see in the mirror. Spend time on yourself. Don't bleach, oh, it leads to cancer. Please. But look good. Be unpredictable. Don't wear the same hairstyle. Try something new. Look at your children. Ah, which one is this? They say it's kinky. So I said, do it on my head. <laughs> I've never had it before. Do it. So they did it. Tell me, put it here, push it here. Thank you, Joe. Push it here, push it. It's not just, that's why we have different wigs. And you don't need to tie scarf everywhere. If they tie scarf in your church, it's good. When you are going to church, put your scarf on. But when you are in the market, must you tie scarf? It's a demonic thing. Now why must you tie scarf everywhere? What? What? Kalabo <laughs> Shantara. Uh -uh. Get fresh air on your head now, madam. Get fresh air. I don't know. It's part of the bondage they have put women into. And these men, when you see them, every morning they put water on their head. They scratch it. We, we must tie scarf. Tie scarf. Please. You have a life. It's just one life. Don't be religious about it. I know what I'm talking about. For 10 years I was in this bondage. I told you yesterday. No jewelry, no makeup, nothing. Scarf, 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 scarf. Now I'm free. God answers my prayer better. I feel like a woman. Don't disobey them in your church. Don't, you know, don't disobey your pastor. But outside church, you have a life. You're not sinning. Enjoy life. Enjoy fresh air. Fresh air from heaven. Put it on your head. I don't like this double standard. Some people, they want to wear earrings to church. And they wear, you meet them and say, no, it can't be. What kind of a life is that? Christianity is not bondage. It can be enjoyed. I want to go to the heaven that Kenneth Copeland's wife is going. I want to go to the heaven that Mommy Adeboye is going. And they are enjoying life. The first time I went to Mommy Adeboye's house, as I sat like this, the housekeeper just came with a tray. He came very close to me and then I was wondering, where is this man going? Just press something, paka. Stool came out, boga. <laughs> ah. He put it in. Ah. And you know, I told her I'm very close to mommy. She beat me and said, mommy, this one, is, this one passed air and go. This one passed. Ah. Jesus Christ. Mama doesn't wear jewelry, but look at her. If you don't wear jewelry, make it up. You can tie a scarf. All this and look on your face. No, 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 no. Get a compact powder. Your husband is a man of God. I kept quiet so that you can think. Please take care of yourself. I must know my time. Huh? that I won't spend too much time on one thing. I say, woman, you belong to the top. Please, like yourself, spend time and money on yourself. That's why you need your money. You don't need to tell daddy every cupboard you spend. That's why you need your money. You want to have a surprise party for daddy. You must now go and take permission from daddy. Then it's no longer a surprise. It's no longer a surprise. I believe in common posts, joint accounts. My son and I, we do. But I have my own. He has his own. You get to a level in life when you have financial maturity, financial independence. You want to give your mommy $30, you must go and beg your husband. It's a silly life. It's a very unscriptural life. It's slavery. It is. Let's talk truth to ourselves. I don't know if that grammar is correct. Believe in yourself. Choose to be happy. There are people that will make you unhappy. Choose. It's a choice. It's a choice. You determine how painful a matter is. Somebody offended you. The person is at Mac Mo McDonald's enjoying. Or the person even, is even having sex with his wife or, her wa or her husband. And here you are. Hey, Jesus. Jesus. Some don't even know that they offended you. You determine the pain. Don't let your life become a trash can. Choose to be happy. Can you please cross your leg? Square your shoulders. 
tell yourself, I'm happy to be alone from Catholic Sade Juma. Once in a while, just open a bottle of wine. I didn't say alcohol, no. <laughs> Pour it into a glass. Move around in your compound. <laughs> your husband says, what's going on? Just tell him, I'm celebrating me. <laughs> you are still spiritual. Even if you want to pray in tongues, Malibu Shakaya Bagasa. Be shaking your body like I'm shaking my own. You want to stand up and try it. Just stand up, walk around for a few seconds. You better celebrate yourself. Carry a glass. Tell yourself, Olufunke, you are trying. You are beautiful. You are a good girl. Uh -uh, it's not easy now to be a mother of four. It's not easy now. Baby girl, you are trying, Joe. You are trying. Shake your body.